Hey everyone, welcome back to another AppTutor tutorial. Do you have a problem where your WhatsApp notifications are not working? If someone sends you a message on WhatsApp and you don't get any notifications on your home screen or lock screen, then this video is for you. I'm going to show you a couple of solutions on how you can fix this problem. So make sure to watch this video until the end so you don't miss any steps. Without wasting your time, let's start with the tutorial. The very first step is to check your Do Not Disturb mode and the Airplane mode. Open the Control Center if you're on your iPhone or the Notification Center if you're on Android. If the Airplane mode is enabled, then turn it off. Similarly, disable the Do Not Disturb option on your phone. If you're on Android, it may have a different name, but make sure that the option is disabled, as this mode can silence notifications. Next, open Settings on your phone and go to the Battery Settings. If you have low power mode enabled, then make sure to disable it. Low power mode restricts background activities, which may prevent your app from refreshing in the background and cause notification issues. If the above steps didn't work, open the settings on your device and then navigate to the notifications settings. Ensure that the show previews option is enabled, set to always. Scroll down through the list until you find WhatsApp. Make sure that the notifications for WhatsApp are enabled and customize these alerts as needed. Ensure that lock screen and home screen notifications are enabled. Next, check the settings in WhatsApp itself. Open the app, click on the settings option, then open notifications. Make sure that the show notifications option is turned on and also enable group notifications if desired. If you still have problems, ensure that background app refresh is enabled on your iPhone or iPad. Go back to your phone settings, then general and select background app refresh. Make sure it's enabled and find WhatsApp in the list. Enable background app refresh for WhatsApp to allow the app to refresh in the background and receive messages. That's it for this video. I hope you were able to fix your problem. If you did, leave a comment down below and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.